no, I, I love that co-op because uh, co it's hard. it's kind of a, a similar thing with Dead Space where it's kind of different for each of the co-op well, that's players. because you have sections where they actually separate. could, like, separate, but you're actually going completely different places. Yeah. Not like, oh, I, uh, you'll cross paths. <laughs> but it's, it's stuff like... Like, I think, I forget whose story it was. I think it might have been, like, near the end of Leon's, where you're running and, uh, like, Ada or Helena's under you, and you're just getting, you see the other person's being chased by, like, an <laughs> army, and you're just like, yeah. oh, well, it sucks to be you. I'm just gonna go kill the boss. You have fun with that. Yeah, my favorite part of that game is, uh, uh spoilers. Uh, there's a part at the end of, uh, you, you two both, you both beat it, right? Yeah. yeah. No, it was not, it was not Chris. It was, a uh, who's the other guy? Alex. Is that his name? The fucking oh, what with Sherry Birkin? Yeah, what's that guy's Alex name? Alex Mercer. It's Alex Mercer. That's Alex pro Mercer. That's prototype. Dude, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh right. I, fuck, what the fuck's his name? It's something Wesker. It's Wes Is it Alex Wesker? Alex, we Alex Wesker. Yeah. Wesker Junior. Uh, Wesker Junior. <laughs> Wesker Junior. <laughs> Wesker Junior. <laughs> Wesker Junior. No, it's like Wesker Junior the Fourth. Because yeah. no. there's like three other Weskers. Oh yeah. But when when you're uh, fighting that uh, was that monster I always find here the Usanak or something like that. Yeah. 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 There's one part at the end where me and my friend were playing. He's like, "Oh God, we finally fucking killed it." That was the fourth time we had to fight that son of a bitch. And, then, and oh, it, that was the one where it burst through the wall. Yeah, and it just, fucking... No, that's the one where the lava was rising. Yeah. And he's just like, Bah! I was like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> oh God! <laughs> oh my God! No! Like, out of lava. And she's like, "Oh my God! It's dead! It's dead!" I mean, oh. wait, no, 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 it's that thing. Because as soon as that happened, I was like, I was playing with my friend for that part. And as soon as that happened, my first instinct, I just, I spaced out because I thought it was over. Right. He popped up, I just went, oh god, Wesker's alive, Wesker's alive. Oh wait, that's not him. <laughs> I mean, yeah, Wesker comes out of the volcano. Wesker's... He got thrown in like years later. Like, he came out of the way. Yeah, I know. He got yeah. thrown into the, uh, the volcano in Africa and swam through the lava up to, up to Europe. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad they didn't put Wesker in the sixth one. They're, I knew they were be... going... I, I really thought... I he's really, probably going to I really back. thought they were going to. Oh, he'll be back. You he'll can't. be back. Oh, yeah. But I'm it's, glad he didn't... It's Resident Evil's signature character. Well, it's not even that. Six proved that. It's not even that. The guy took an RPG to the face and was unfazed. The guy was swimming... The guy was swimming in lava and clearly wasn't getting Global killed, so you know he's still alive. <laughs> if the guy is swimming joyfully in lava, obviously him sitting in it in a couple of minutes after an RPG to the face ain't gonna do much. Like, yeah. who is the last boss of Resident Evil 6? Uh, a business dude who got backstabbed by a random gang member who then <laughs> became the Brundlefly. <laughs> the the Brundlefly. Brundle <laughs> do you remember That's, it turned into yeah. a fucking moth? moth. Yeah, that stupid <laughs> ass moth. Oh my, why does every boss have to turn into the grossest fucking thing? Right. Why can't you just because turn into a big dude? Evil. You can't just turn into a titan or something. Right? Like, titan? Yeah, that'd be better. <laughs> no, no, you turn into no. like a, a thing with like 5,000 yeah, tentacles. <laughs> better, better yet, you just see a businessman jump off the roof of a skyscraper, then you just see... Bite his thumb. No, 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 then you just see one. Gypsy Danger's head slowly come up from the other side of the building. It's like, yeah. oh shit, we're oh, fighting yeah. fucking Jaegers now. Pacific Rim. Uh, remember when Leon and Helena have to fight it up top of that building? And Leon yeah, has a cutscene when it cuts scene when it goes into that crazy ass insane moth form thing. Yeah. Helena doesn't see it immediately. No. She, you're too busy She's doing a random thing. So I'll well, no, my no. friend Raz, Leon, he's like Leon's staring at that and yeah. Helena is too busy trying to keep them alive by shooting soldiers and zombies. Yeah. And so, Leon's just like, Wow, look at that halo and it's like can yeah, you fucking I, help I, me for a second? I was doing whatever it is you have to do at that time and I was playing with my friend Raz. He's like, hey Matt, you might want to hurry up I'm like why is it cause this thing and I turn I'm like, oh, oh no that's a problem. <laughs> Hold on a minute <laughs> <laughs> I think my favorite boss, one of my favorite Resident Evil boss was the uh, was uh, what's his name from uh, four, uh, the final the final uh, guy. Oh, what's his name? I know I can't believe. Oh his shit! Guy. But he turns into that really Le weird Leon's monster. enemy or, or like arch enemy, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, Wait, are you not not Kratos? not not Krauser, not Osmond? Oh, okay. No, no, the final oh, the, final the, guy, the, the church Sattler. Sa no, Sattler. Yeah. Okay. Oh boy! He was the final guy. The guy. Salazar was the Salaz one, was, yeah. was the uh, was the other guy. Yes, he was the Sattler uh, Napoleon was the, guy. Was the final guy you fight? Yeah. I, it's my fear of You're boss a battle time set. because when if you don't <laughs> if you don't know about that battle, yeah, it's a bitch to fucking kill him. If you know about that, it, he transforms. And my I play it with my friend, and I, I bet it was like 50, I bet him like twenty bucks that I could beat it faster than him because he was like one of the arrogant. I'm great at this game. Everyone else could. Kiss my ass. So we beat him in like five minutes. I'm like, I, I can do that better. So we reloaded it. 
I sold all the stuff out of my inventory and bought one weapon. He's like, you're really going to kill it with that? I'm like, yep, I only need one shot. So he transformed. As soon as I got control, I took out my RPG, shot in the eye once, and instant killed. I'm just yeah. like, the fight lasted maybe 10 seconds because I just <laughs> used an RPG once on his main eye and it yeah. killed him. Oh, what it's, a badass. No, it's, it's, no, it's just <laughs> like... It, it, it's my favorite one because it leads up to this so much and if you're not ready for the boss fight it's a pain in the ass but if you're ready for it it is one of the easiest boss fights in the entire Resident Evil series yeah. to win I did it with the Red 9 the first time I did it I just, yeah you could kill him with a pistol it's, you just I, have to know I got you fucked up a lot but yeah. I, I did it with the Red 9 and then the rocket launcher thrown to you if anything the only time I used I because I had to use I, know, I didn't have to Actually, I just didn't want to put up with it. Was I died twice on the actual Salazar battle? Yeah. When he's in that giant stupid form, I couldn't figure out how to do it. No, the so easy... I just shot him open, and then I yeah. went, fuck it, and just killed him with one yeah. shot. Well, the... All it is is one shot kill. <laughs> well, here, that here's half a... hour boss is If done. anyone wants to save time in that battle, you just move all the way to the end, the far left or far right of the platform, and he can't touch you. Seriously? So you just... Yeah, the tentacles can't hit you. Unless Bottom it's like... platform or top the top, no, not the floor, the platform. If you're all the way at the very right or very uh, left corner, the tentacles pretty much cannot touch you. Bullshit. Except when you're like sweeping across, but uh, when you're going up and down, they pretty much can't hit you. That's so it, I just stand there, like I just shoot it until, you? until Salazar comes down, just hit him with an RPG. That's ridiculous. I just like go, all right, hold up, machine gun. Just don't even have to be that accurate. Just kind <laughs> of yeah. hit him yeah. until he opens up, and then a rocket shot, and then that's it. That's the boss. Yeah. It's, it's bullshit. Yeah, it, but it's great. It's bullshit. That's great. Resident Evil 4 is good. It's amazing. It's a, uh, until, it's right. like, as long as you're not playing it on Xbox. Yeah, uh, yeah Xbox those controls you cannot adjust to. Yeah, it, I, I couldn't. Like, I was oh, playing we're the, done. the first part of that game I've played maybe 30 times in my life. Where, of course, you, you have to go freaking see what's up in the cabin. And it, was a, it was a dude, he's like, Ooja Yeah, then there's always that you. one person that accidentally triggers chainsaw guy and that first time they play they trigger chainsaw chainsaw guy and it's just a mass panic so they don't know how to oh, deal with this i hate yeah. chainsaw guy you, you, you it's been 30 minutes and you already got a guy with a fucking chainsaw 30 yeah. minutes that's within the butt. first 10 minutes well if you, if i took my time the bi- village <laughs> trade for the shotgun you're screwed well i don't i, don't, I didn't rush through it because there's like trip mines and well shit no that's what i'm saying if you go straight up. for the shotgun you're screwed because he's gonna come right for your ass. I, I have. A oh, strat- that, I already have my yeah. set strategy for it. Okay. That's it's it's you have to go to the back. It's like the back houses. Jump through the window. Um, even if there's glass there, you can jump through it. No one will fucking know. You'll jump through that window. Well, that and then you start doors. And it's and it's uh you jump through the window where that one girl is kind of just doing a a random task behind it. There's like red herbs and shit near. You just jump in there, start killing as many people as you can. Until the chainsaw guy, the moment he comes in through the window or the door, go the other way, or if it's actually the window, I kind of defend near it, go out the window, go into that house that causes that cutscene with the shotgun, just kind of like barge everything up, grab the shotgun, defend from there until I can jump out the window, then go into that one house that has two doors. I, I'll, I'll okay. say until, until, until you get, okay. it's the best way to get, get to the All castle. Right. The, if you uh, uh, do the chainsaw guy, it screws you over up till the castle with ammo because it takes so much to kill him. I feel like the we thing should... I do is I just go into the village and I have to use the binoculars. Yeah, I just shoot a random shot to get everyone's attention, and you just wait. You wait for them to come to you and group up, and then you just kneecap one of them. Okay. Just like shoot one of them in the kneecap, he drops down, and then you round. And then you can just roundhouse him, and he'll hit everyone in the nearby area. <laughs> yeah, just, and like, that because like, one you do that, one you do damage to all of them, and then honestly, they can only handle one or two roundhouses. Right. So yeah. it's an easy way, and you save a hell of a lot of ammo by yeah. shooting him in the leg. I I feel like we should that's, do a you can also just it. yeah, yeah you can should, also shoot him in the leg. Uh, yeah. I just shoot him in the leg and just knife him the fucking death while they're lying on the ground. Yeah. You, have a, you have a Wii at your house, right? Yeah. We can play. Uh, I have, we can play I have on a Wii U, but it's the same shit. I guess. All right, can they play GameCube games? We're, we're no, some... but I have a GameCube. Okay. All right. Let's play. <laughs> I <laughs> also have a oh, PS2. Do you want to yeah. use that too? Yeah. That's the harder oh, version. Yeah. Chris, Chris, well, I have it on GameCube. Have all that. Okay. Huh? Like I said you probably have all that too. Yeah, I have yeah. it on GameCube. So. But like the problem. I have like three GameCubes. The problem with the of playing it though is that whoever's playing it. May have to tag out for the person who w- wants to do the castle, because I'll do the castle. I'll, I'll play yeah. up until the castle. I the castle, once it. you know what you're doing, isn't that hard. Yeah, it's right after the castle with those goddamn regenerators. If you don't yeah. know what you're doing, you are screwed. It's mm-hmm. re- which oh, still haunt my dreams. 
<laughs> no, the regenerator <laughs> doesn't. It's the Iron Maiden because that thing, if you shoot <laughs> the Which regenerator, the Iron, Maiden again? the Iron Maiden is the one with all the spikes. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. the regenerator. Yeah. If you hit it, it's it falls on the ground. That sucks for it. <laughs> the yeah, Iron but then Maiden. it flops its way up and down. Yeah, but it, it's oh. not fast. But if you shoot the Iron Maiden onto the ground, you just fucked up because now the Iron Maiden moves faster on the ground. Yeah. <laughs> And then it all of a sudden goes into Soul Eater fucking bloody needles and because its freaking body can throw out spikes as far as the eye can see. Yeah, it's right. a bullshit attack. Yeah, so Resident Evil. We'll, that'll be, we'll play that. I don't know, I guess. Uh, I, think, I think we need to We should play it on GameCube, though. Well, no. I, I, I'm not good with that. Uh, I, I was going to say, I uh, think we need to play like the director's cut only... original Resident Evil first. Oh, the original yeah. Resident Evil? I, I don't, that, think, I, I don't think I ever uh, beat Resident Evil. I have that, actually. Do you? I okay. have to say that, I have it too, so. that, yeah, that one I have to say I missed that had one it's, of my favorite enemies really that good. I missed oh, actually. and that's the hunters. I was gonna say is it the I think it, I think her name is Tara Burt. Uh, maybe maybe Tara, Tara Burt. No, no, you're no, probably it's, thinking it's, of Lisa Trevor. Yes, Lisa Trevor. Okay. Uh, she, she is scary as hell. Well, that's because you can't kill her, and she's actually the main reason for like all the subsequent games. Really? She well she well the G virus came from you mixing of the. We've gone on a Resident Evil tangent. We'll just yeah. stick with it. Uh, Are you cast? Um, <laughs> if you also, if you haven't realized, I'm a really big fan of the Resident Evil series, and I know way much yeah. m- about it. More way about way it than I really should. Way much about it. Yeah, really. I know way much of the about. Uh, pretty <laughs> much, William Birkin's G virus was derived from Lisa Trevor's T virus, which morphed into the Nemesis virus. Mm-hmm. So they got the Nemesis virus from her, and then all subsequent, then like G virus was made off the. And, uh, Nemesis of Veronica was off G, and then C virus was off Veronica. So, so pretty much everything. Lisa's from the after, original. She was one of the first they tested the T virus on. Yeah, and then she became this horrible thing that you never kill. You can't kill it. No, I mean you. You honestly can't kill. It. Like they, I think they have tried every way to kill her. They have decapitated her, burned her alive, dismembered her, buried her alive, and all that did was piss her off. You know what that means? That at, out of out of all the hundred, all the games, give me that look. <laughs> all those games that are out, mm-hmm. that character's still alive. It, she I is. Hope she's in Resident Evil Seven. Isn't isn't Barry Burton still alive? Who? Barry Burton. You know, guns. No, I, Barry. You know, you know guns. Yeah, no, Barry. they must never heard from Burton too. He saves no, he saves know. Jill Valentine and then never heard from again. I thought his last name was Burton. Is it Barry Burton? I thought that was his full Barry name. Barry Burton. Oh, yeah. Barry. Yeah, just, just, I thought his last name was Burton, too. It's, Barry Burton, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, there you go. I was right. I have. Yeah, you were right. I know everything. I know you were. That's what I'm saying. This. That's what I'm saying. He saves <laughs> uh, Jill you at the end of... You almost turned into a Jill, Jill sandwich. sandwich. <laughs> she I high five my saves TV. Jill, He saves Jill <laughs> at the end of Resident Evil 3, and then is never heard from again. That's oh, really? Oh, that's, he uh, just, he's he like, I saved you. I'm fucking off, because I'm not dealing with this shit anymore. I'm back. See you later. Uh, isn't there like an ending in Resident Evil where he actually does die though? Yeah, that was with uh, the first one where they had like a ton of different endings. Yeah, well, that was like the bullshit ending. That was like the the one that isn't. Well, no, the it, worst it's... ending you can get. No, yeah, the first yeah. it's it's everyone thinks he's dead. Oh really? Okay, I never because I never it, watched. It. I only much, heard that. It was yeah, like, it's oh. in the first game. You come across him and he's been. Uh, Wesker already shot him and he's bleeding out. And then he looks like he dies, but he's actually just fake, faked, it, faked it. And then right before the place explodes, he was able to crawl out. And then that's why he saves Jill in a three. is because everyone thinks he's dead, but he's not. Because it was yeah. Wesker took his family hostage. So he yeah. faked his death to escape, to uh, get under Umbrella's radar, and then save his family. And then after that, he went to save Jill. Right. Uh, I don't think I ever beat a Resident Evil game besides four and six. Uh, even six, I didn't beat the Ada campaign, so I guess <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't beat the whole thing. So it only was four. Yeah, it oh, was. Yeah. It was like the first all, part's all, like you stealth, like no, both that, fuck you. Both yeah. that and four Ada's. I, th- I think she might have had one in five too. Uh, I don't I think don't she remember. was even in five. I, I know she wasn't. That's why it was really weird that uh, I think she had a mission in, in five, which okay. made it real weird. Um, yeah, five was the I think. Yeah, I got so close to beating that, just like in Resident Evil Six, and then the last like <laughs> and then you started, the last two chapters of uh, the, and then I once you started six, punching a bol- boulder, so I didn't even get like, to yeah, that. I'm done. I didn't even get to that. <laughs> I'm I was punching like, boulders into mercy. I was like, you know what? I'm just done playing this game. And my friend said, yeah, you punch a boulder and you're fucking out of a. Uh, you're, also, you're just, you're just fuck off. Also, future in a uh, future gore plays it has finished downloading and it's ready to go. Okay, cool. All right, so also, uh, also just on a side note, that first Resident Evil game has probably. One of the best cinematic moments in 
game history, which is this is that one zombie. <laughs> That first one oh, that yeah, turns yeah. around and oh, just looks over his shoulder. It's he's like, just like, you're that, fucked. Yeah, that's just one of the You done goofed. You're no, done because fucked that goofed. happens, and then it doesn't even cut to a black screen. It just cuts from that straight back into game. Yeah. yeah. And you're yeah. just like, at that moment, it starts standing up, and you're just, well, fuck. Oh, well, I just love me, man. <laughs> Go ahead. I will say, though, that that game was fantastic, and the remake was one of the worst atrocities to ever... Really? Yeah. I heard this remake's supposed to be really good. <laughs> Wait, the remake the for what? You, for, for Resident, Resident 1. Evil, for GameCube. I was good. That was a nightmare. Really? You could, wow. Here's the thing. Uh, the other game. Sorry, we'll kill them and we go on and do these problems. Here was, uh, re this was the remake. All right, I killed the zombie. Now I gotta go get a lighter and I gotta get fuel and I gotta burn this body within the next five minutes or it's gonna come back to life even faster and stronger with more health than before. So now I gotta stop everything just to burn this body. It's like... I don't want to do that. I just want to play the game, not have to burn every single body I have in every five minutes. I have to run to get more gasoline. Yeah, fair, that was an annoying games, part. But other than that, though, it actually was pretty big. It was. Well, it was a lot better. But that one part just takes away so much because you constantly yeah. have to stop progressing. That's the only version just of the game I have. Just to get fucking gasoline. That's the only version of the game I have. So when we yeah. play it. That's what we have to play. No, okay. we have to play the original. I, I have we have a, to play the, I have the original the director's cut so we can get all the live action horrible cinematics. Because oh, yeah. 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 the first one had, but, had my the theory is Rebecca the Chambers. She's just like, what's, what's up? I'm Rebecca Chambers. Resident Evil <laughs> Zero. I'm, I'm not relevant past this game. Even yeah. I, I, I will say, even I though I'm the main character I mean, in Zero. Yeah. <laughs> I will say, I'll I, I'll be, be, I love her prequel. in Zero because she was like a true badass. I have, I have Zero also. We can play that. Zero, she well, was a badass. I should say, I have, I it, on, I have it on Wii. So, I mean, it's the same thing. It's a GameCube version, except you have to. I think play with the Wiimote? I can't remember. Uh, I never, I never no, that it. might have been Dark Side Chronicles or Umbrella okay. Chronicles. Okay. Okay. You know, well, no, I, I do have Zero yeah. in the remake. Oh, no, no. Yeah, Zero, yeah, you had to use the fucking Wii remote for okay. that shit to aim. Oh. It was so stupid. What? How does that even work with tank controls? You just... Oh, it doesn't fuck. work at all. <laughs> it does. It probably doesn't. It, that's it, why it I, I tried playing the each. I tried to play Resident Evil remake on Wii, and I was just like, screw this. This is, this is a nightmare. Because you go from the fixed camera, the first person, then back to fixed camera. I'm just like, no, no, please don't. I'm done. All right. Uh, so uh, we went on way longer than we wanted to. Um, Resident yeah, Evil. We talk about a lot of stuff. Um, <laughs> just one, one last thing I want to say. Uh, a bunch of shit came out this week and stuff oh, that yeah. hasn't come out this week. There's two things I really want to mention, though. I I'll mention everything else, but two things I really want to mention. Fable came out the Ooh, anniversary. Fable like anniversary. It. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I love the first Fable. Fable, Fable, is Fable, a Fable yeah, the it. lost chapters. Fable Peter Molyneux. You were yeah. perfect the first time. With a, I believe God, with, did you drop the ball? <laughs> yeah, but it's I love with Fable all the, too, It's with all DLC too, right? Yeah, yeah. It, it comes yeah. With all the DLC. plus added stuff. Yeah. yeah, more armors, more weapons. Yeah, which are really unnecessary once you make a few a decent amount. You're of money. You're just gonna get played mail and finish it with that anyway. Yeah, so anyway, that came out. We didn't play that yet. Uh, we uh, wanted to, but yeah, we didn't have enough time. Yeah, we, yeah, we won't have time tonight. We're but racing I, against snow tonight. <laughs> yeah. Um, Fable came out. Uh, I'll, I'll play it. Um, I bought it, so I'll play it. Um, Bravely Default comes out. Have you heard of that game? Yes. I played I, I, a demo of uh, it at my job. Yeah, yeah a like, lot of people balls, thought it was it three. And then... Is it really difficult? It's. I went through... Maybe it's because the guy who was doing the demo of it didn't properly equip himself. Okay. But I went into just... A, like, he said it was since it's like the demo he went to the first dungeon that you're supposed to go to Okay. there's four there's four goblins you have four people I mean all four of my people attack what sounded like the best titled minion to sound the worst all four of them would hit him twice never kill him I would be dead in two turns wow it was bo well, it was well, so well, fucking big, yeah, that's 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 a, that about is a game the, that's on easy mode the big thing I played. I heard about <laughs> yeah. the game is it was looked great and leading up to it was a, like looked awesome it'd be a lot of fun and then people have started playing it and just saying it's like a so-so game really it's it, been getting it, really it, good reviews yeah I it's like not it it, i mean yeah. it, it, it's not like colonial marines insanity where oh, yeah. it's like it's not anywhere near our standards it's just we expected a lot more out of this it's still a good game but we really expected a lot more out of it yeah. I don't know. I didn't know what to expect out of it, so I'm not sure what I. So, <laughs> so you my, have no standards. My, no, it's not that I don't have standards. I don't know what I'm basing it off of. Yeah, so I'm right. going in here with this. Other than the demo I played, which, by the way, is a 10 hour demo you can yeah. get. It has wow. save points, yeah. And what. Sorry. And whatever progress you've made or like equipment and whatnot will transfer over to when you actually buy the game. 
The only other game to do that was Lunar for the PlayStation 1. Oh, yeah, Lunar. I love Lunar. Yeah, I. that's a game I never played, but I played the demo the whole way through. Wow. And nice. I only remember... And I still know of the game, but I forgot his name until my brother reminded me of it yesterday. Remember Breath of Fire? Yes. Yeah, I used to Three love Three was it. the best. Uh, I think that's the one I played all the way through and fucking loved Is it. that when oh, you start so off as the boy whose attack was he would put his hand on his head <laughs> and just wave his sword because he was too yeah, afraid? I, I think so. I played two on the Game Boy Advance also. There was, that was actually really good too. there was a too. game, uh, I think it was Golden Sun, where yeah, you actually, yeah, had, I love you actually Sun. had the oh, uh, solar panel in the cartridge. Oh, no, that's Boktai. Boktai. Right? That Boktai, yeah. okay. Yeah, you I had like the Boktai solar too. panel in your cartridge to power up your gun in-game. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. it's like if you're playing it in a dark room, you were screwed because you fucked. couldn't use your weapon at all. I put it to a that light. Was so I was like, cool. please work. And I was yeah. like, fuck, it's yeah, not Yeah, it's working. like, crap, it needs UV rays. Where's a black light when you need one? Right. Yeah. Now, that's the only thing that sucked about it is that I, I like to play games when I'm in bed. I'm like, oh, I need to go to sleep. Yeah, it's like if you want to play that game, you fucking need, sun. Yeah, you needed a blacklight if you wanted to play that game. Yeah. <laughs> I do most of my gaming at night. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that was a good game. I bought, yeah. you, met, you mentioned Golden Sun. I love Golden Sun. Golden Sun is so fantastic. Good. Now, I tried to play the DS one that just came out like well, a couple years ago, but yeah. I couldn't get into it. I really couldn't. Yeah, I bought it and was like, ah, I'm not sure if the game didn't age well or just didn't transfer. Or, well. or we uh, aged well. Or, or we aged well. <laughs> we <too>. outgrew it. <laughs> yeah, we oh. outgrew Golden Sun. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, we also play, oh, yeah, no, wait. I think More Wolf stuff Among Us out. comes out. Yeah, oh. Wolf Among Us tomorrow. It's been four months since episode one. Oh, fucking really weird. Well, that yeah. comes out, I think, I Walking, the next season of Walking Dead's coming out either end of this month, beginning yeah. of next month. You mean the next episode? Yeah, that's what I said, the yeah, next yeah. episode of The Walking Dead. You said season. Yeah, you said See, season. Next, next episode. The first podcast ever. got it. Pod, the podcast gods will judge Fillet you. him. <laughs> it's still not as bad as you. You have to say man. you're a dumb butt. It's not as bad as you on our, the last podcast we were on where it took you 30 seconds to realize you just returned Wait. from the past of seeing the future. Hell please. yeah, buddy. <laughs> say you're a dumb butt. Say you're a dumb butt. That has to be our thing I'm when you fuck. I'm a shitlord. I'm an asshole. No. I'm not a dumb butt. I'm an yeah. asshole. You're a dick butt. You're, you're a, a dick butt. That, now you're a dick butt. You're worse yeah. than a you're dumb butt. You're worse than a dumb butt. <laughs> got a dick on your butt. <laughs> Uh, dick, dick up my butt. I got a dick in my butt. Oh, I uh, got cock from ass. <laughs> Sparty kiss. My Jupiter's cock. <laughs> Jupiter's cock. Um, uh, actually, well, I don't, yeah, I don't blame them for, the, for Wolf Among Us for being four months late. Well, <laughs> they said they had problems with it. Like, they, they couldn't yeah. get the engine to work or something like that. Yeah. So, it would have been out probably December. Yeah, but it's, I don't blame them even on that because they're working on, for those who don't know, or for those who do. They're also working on, aside from The Walking Dead, aside from every Wolf other Among game Us, in the world. They're also working on Game, game of, Thrones of Thrones and Borderlands. And, yep, and Borderlands. Didn't they? Didn't they? Tales from do- Borderlands. Tales they, from the Borderlands. Yeah. Didn't they announce they were doing something else too? Uh, yeah, I feel like they, they, they did. There's two other games they're working <laughs> on. There's two other games working on. I think they may have said something about a third. They okay. also might be, but oh I, only, I can only confirm. <laughs> Okay. Did you know they made a Law and Order series? Yes. I never knew that. They made a Law and Order, a CSI, and uh, did they make a CSI? Oh wait, you mean video games or just? No, no, no. I'm talking about Telltale. Oh, Telltale. Telltale made a Law and Order. I was gonna say video game wise, yeah. There's Law and Order, CSI, and CIS. I played that one. That one sucked. And CIS. We, you, we both know NCIS, the worst game of the play, easiest game to get uh, max out achievements. In. Yeah, because you just hit, you just mash the A button the whole time. And you get max. It's a part where you play the main character. Forgot his the fucking character's name I, because I never yeah. watched the show. But you actually have to do some uncharted shit where you're actually hanging off a ledge on the yeah. side of a building. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? I thought I was playing NCIS the game, not Uncharted Four uh, Among Fucks or something. <laughs> among Fucks. <laughs> among Fucks. Uh, uh, what else? We got uh, Dead Island for games for gold. Yeah, everybody yeah. out there, if you have an Xbox 360, you can get Dead Island right now for free. I forget what's that coming was. out after that. I forget which game it is uh, off the top of my head. Oh, God. Uh, oh, it was, oh, it was yeah. something Toy okay. Soldiers. Right. Toy Soldiers, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You get Toy Soldiers for free. Toy too. Soldiers. Really? Uh, yep. What is PlayStation Plus? It's Outlast. What oh, yeah. Well, they have way yeah. better stuff. Did we mention Outlast yeah. is free now? Or? Yeah, Outlast is free, and it's uh, <laughs> it's 20 bucks if you don't have PS Plus. So... <laughs> Uh, from get, what I've heard, it's good, get so it's PS worth it. Plus anyway. yeah. Might as well just get one month of PS Plus just to play that game. No, just know? get a whole year, because you, honestly, you'll make that money back that this month. month. This yeah. month, you'll make it back, because you get you still have Bioshock, you have Metro Last Light now, which is free. Which you is get, a great game, by the way. so like, good. Yeah. I love that game. You may be a little confused, but they do summarize what happened at the end of the first game. Here's, here's still the, a little confusing. It's okay. Okay. No, here's okay. the simple thing. With like PlayStation Plus game for gold, even if you don't want the game... 
get it anyway because it's free, so yeah. why the hell wouldn't you? Yeah. Oh, you don't even DMC, need to download Devil May Cry it. is also free. Yeah, Devil yeah. May Cry is also free. Get it. So it's Amazing like, get, it, get yeah. it. Even if you play it two minutes and never again, you got it for free, why the hell wouldn't you download it? Right there, it? that's like $100 right there. Yeah. Yeah. Get yeah. it for 50 bucks. It's pretty good. I think good. LS is an indie game, right? Yeah, it is. An LS, indie. Yeah. yeah, it's an indie game. Yeah. You know, it's the it's, best indie horror game. Yeah. Wasn't it I know indie, it's one of the best looking games on PS4. Wasn't also. it? Uh, yeah. It was either that's worth, even more horrible. Was it worked <laughs> by the people from Amnesia, or was it just the consultant? Think, I think I, I can't remember. I can't remember. I don't remember exactly what around, company yeah. these guys came from. I have a feeling it's a Call of Duty company or something that a bunch of guys left and they were like, you know what, let's just make a fucking. Because I know Outlast, they did address multiple times that they were ref they referred to Amnesia a bunch yeah. of times, which yeah. is which never happens unless either you're working with those people or some of those people are working on that game. But I do remember that it was a couple guys from a different studio yeah. made their own studio and made Outlast. I can't remember what game it was though. Is it all clear out there, Matt? Yeah. Okay. It good. is okay. Yeah, because we're racing against the snow. Yeah. God damn it, so sick of it. I don't, I don't think it's going to snow for a couple more hours. But, uh... <laughs> I just but, don't uh, want it to snow, period. New York sucks. Yeah. Go, I'm going down to my mom's house okay. in the U.S. <laughs> Screw it all. All right. For people that are listening, away. if you live in Florida and have a room fuck vacant... You. <laughs> fuck, fuck you. Fuck you. Go well, to I was Key gonna, West. I, I was trying to help you. If you have a room I told vacant... You, my, I my mom is house it. in Key West. I'll just go and stay there. I'll just fly down with a, hey, mom, I'm here. Look for this nerd you thought you Casey were... <laughs> in his house. You, you can tell. He, he has glasses and he looks like an asshole. So... That that is that everyone that in Key West? Between Whoa. Me and you. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> gotcha, Florida. <laughs> Such sick birds. Sick, sick country birds. <laughs> uh, so, even though it's a state. And Casey uh, looks at us like, wow, asshole. Well, it, it doesn't bother well, me. Like just I said, me I, I can say all that. So I'll just go to one of my friend's house or my mom's house down there and just stay there. Oh, no, um, I wasn't saying, we, like, we call him an asshole. Like, just what... Terrible jokes you've just. <laughs> I am an asshole. Like, oh no, That's, you should know that. There's one thing with me everyone should know, but no one remembers. You never set me up to take a cheap shot at you or make a bad pun because I will take every advantage of that. Oh, <laughs> you're an asshole, so we are aware oh, yeah. of that. I, I don't hide Painfully. that fact. I, I admit it. I'm an you're asshole. A painful asshole. I mean, I'll be nice and you're respectful, like, but if I if I know, no, no. I'll be nice oh, and respectful to people. That. But if I know, like, if I'm good friends, like with I am with you two, I'll be an asshole all the time. I don't hate you, but that's, I'm just gonna be a straight up asshole. Do. Yeah. Uh, so what else is there on the okay. list that okay. we have to do? What what are no wait. What are, what are games come out? Oh yeah, know. but I've I, that's actually all I knew was Bravely Default, whatever's on PS, whatever's on the PlayStation Plus, what's ever on Gold, Bravely Default, um, Wolf Among Wolf Us. Wolf Among Us. I guess that's it. Fable. And Fable, there you go. That's it. Uh, all right, that's all the games. Coming. Unless there's any like DVDs or anything. There's there. probably is something there we're gonna look in like five minutes and realize, oh my god, Unless how can we not have said that? Any anime worth mentioning? Yeah. But, but well, Lego, we Lego can do that in the next one because I have to go through my gigantic list of anime. Yeah. Like, there, I'm not kidding. There's like a good between OVAs, movies, and series. There's a good list of 400 that I'm either I watched and watching or I've stopped watching. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go through and figure that. out. Yeah, the Lego Movie also comes out. And I'm actually really excited for that. So. Oh, okay. There you go. I, Any I, movie I'm that's still on the fence about that. Well, it's been like getting I really said, good Matt, reviews. It's, it's the first probably. time a movie has gotten Morgan Freeman to read the phone book. You, yeah. That that instantly was like, you know what? I'm gonna see it. The first ever movie. He's been in like eighty if that's movies last year. Somehow a selling point. Sure, I'm that's in. a selling point. Of course, they should put that around a poster. He Morgan reads Freeman a reads a phone book. Phone book. <laughs> How do you nerds not jerking off to that? <laughs> that's on the poster too. <laughs> well, they actually got a lot of big names. They got a lot of big names for that. Yeah, they, they did. did. They got yeah. him. They got Will Ferrell. Yeah, they got uh, Will Pratt. I'm mean, sorry, no, Will Pratt. Pratt. Chris Pratt. Chris Pratt. Who's a uh, who's a uh, is he? Well, no, I, no, he's Batman. No, Will Arnett is uh, Batman from com uh, not Community. God damn, I mixed all my shit. Parks and uh, yeah, Parks and Rec. No, no, <laughs> Arrested Development. There you That's go. what I meant to say. You fucking said Parks I was and Rec. Right. Please don't reference this other terrible show. <laughs> Parks and Rec was was pretty good. Yeah, he, Parks and Rec. Parks is, and Rec had the freaking uh, Chris Patton, Oswald, uh, Patton Oswald uh, rant about Star Wars oh, and Mar oh. Marvel and all the universes colliding. <laughs> that was good. Uh, so let's see. Aside from that, movies. Uh, George Clooney movie comes out. Uh, Monument Man. That, yeah, looks, that actually looks really good. It's been getting bad reviews. Uh, what, which gravity? Is, uh, no, no, no. Yeah, Man. Gravity comes out again. Uh, yeah, gravity two already. No. Gravity uh, two. It's too much to handle. The Monuments Man. You ever heard of that one? It's it's got it's no. one. It's like the this 
it's this year's big Expendables type movie. It's oh. it's, a, it's, for it, old it's people that George don't Clooney, Ben Affleck. No, uh, Matt Damon. Matt Damon, excuse me. Uh, who else? They got like a George ton. Clooney, Matt Damon, Bill Murray, uh, Bill John Murray. Goodman, uh, that guy from The Artist. Uh, <laughs> that guy from The Artist. Uh, a bunch of other people. Uh, All right. Uh, now, Kate Blanchett. It's about them trying to steal back uh, art from the Germans during uh, during World it, War Two. It's, the, it's wow. about the okay. guys that stole art from Hitler. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. There you okay. Go. Fine. Yeah, it looks interesting. And it's actually a true story. It is a true story. Yeah. I forget. I, think, I actually stole think it was. Yeah. I think I can't remember who. I think someone in my family was involved in the, in yeah. that. Not uh, the monument, but stealing artwork from his house <laughs> after uh, after Germany fell. Just like, okay, my family uh, is, a, is a bunch of assholes. George Clooney <laughs> stole artwork him. from Hitler. <laughs> that person you're talking about play, uh, is played by George Clooney. Hitler? Yeah, Hitler. Yeah, Hitler. 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 I said Hitler, Hitler, and you said that no, guy is played by George Clooney. You said you knew Clooney. someone that stole art from Hitler. That's who I was fucking talking about. Never George mind. The, tra- <laughs> the joke's over. The yeah, joke's done. <laughs> we have to Fuck move it. on now. We've ruined it. <laughs> you ruined my funny ass joke. It was the best joke <laughs> ever. The I joke. was going to pee my pants. <laughs> you ruined it. My big boy pants were going oh, to be my, drenched. Oh, my big boy pants. <laughs> my only pants. <laughs> my <laughs> only <laughs> pants. I have this one pair of pants. I, I clean I it every day. I have nothing else. I else. clean them with my pee. <laughs> <laughs> I got nothing else to have clean it with my period. <laughs> if you haven't noticed by now, without Gerard to keep us in line, we're all out of our freaking minds. He's gonna listen to this and be like, wow, what George, is happening? George is gonna be this like, shit what? got real. George's like, is this what it's like when I'm not around? Oh my god, they need me. I need to be the voice of reason. Gerard, if you for some reason listen to this, we need you. <laughs> Gerard, if you're listening probably, to this, why aren't you here right he's now? He's probably playing an Assassin's Creed game, jerking off. <laughs> learning more about Ezio. You learn so, you learn even more about nothing in this game. <laughs> Cause that's what you learned in like, Revelations was no, fuck nothing. Like I said, like, I keep telling you, Black Flag is nothing but a pure fan service game. Everyone wanted a Pirates Assassin's Creed, right. so they gave them That's Pirates what Assassin's Revelations Creed. and Pirates no, no, of the but Caribbean this, were whatever. This, this one has nothing <laughs> that, it cannot it does not advance. Any story whatsoever, nothing of any historical di- uh, importance has ever happened involving no. pirates. No. So it was pure. Fa- it was pure fan service. Yeah, there's no point of Assassin's Creed Four, but I like it. So I like right. the ship battles. I, I hate, hate it. I which hate is it about eighty percent of the game. So, yeah. My the copy is like so battles. fucking yeah. glitched. I hate the game. Really? You hate it? I told you. I I've had. I've gotten to the point. Where I I almost threw my mouse into a wall last night because I just couldn't deal with how glitchy it was. That was the same thing I had with Last of Us. Great game. I couldn't really. Play I know it it's my a great game, but my experience has been so destroyed. I cannot. Good. I cannot get back into that game. If I play it again, I really. I probably would. If yeah, but I don't want to buy good. it again. But also, I want to play the DLC. Yeah, the next next week is the DLC. It comes out on oh. Valentine's Day. Yeah. Really. <laughs> Yeah, Valentine's Day. What, what was the name of the DC? It's like all, all, like all left behind. Left behind. behind. I'm like, yeah, that's a great <laughs> title for DLC on Valentine's Day. It's like it's all these Valentine's Day movies coming out, I'm gonna be like, oh, hell, I'm gonna play some Left for Dead. And, and left then for it's, us. it's left, just gonna fuck. be like, left, 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 left behind. Thank you. <laughs> I hey can girl, just say I'll now, I'm gonna have the obligatory <laughs> at midnight on on Valentine's Day. You're just gonna see automatically on my wall on my. Facebook, just the video of Futurama with Fry just saying, "Oh crap, it's Valentine's Day, and I forgot to get a girlfriend again." And I'll just post that like every hour on Valentine's Day. Oh, I forgot Day. to get a girlfriend. girlfriend. <laughs> That's one of my favorite lines from Futurama. It's still really Valentine's good. Day. Say, oh, girlfriend. oh man, I forgot Tell to get a girlfriend wife, again. I said hello. <laughs> All right, so I will say though that series had one of the best endings ever. That last I, I didn't, was I didn't watch it. I know, I know, what? it ended like. Did you see the last? No, I, yeah, I watched. I it. it was great. I watched Futurama all the way until they canceled it, and then I never watched any of the newer. <laughs> wait, wait, rates. until they canceled it. Which time? The first, the second, first time. third time. The, 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 so the big one. You never saw like the newest seasons. No, like seven, the newest eight, nine. No. Well, to None. be fair, the set the first time it came back, a majority of that was just all the DVD stuff they turned into episodes. Right. Oh, okay. Okay, well, yeah, the, the movies I've watched. Because that's what you're talking about. Yeah, then you, yeah, that was most of the second coming. The last two seasons were were pretty good, though. Three? Okay. It was three? Mm-hmm. Oh, right, because there was two seasons, and then, like, two years between the, the, between the, the last one came out. Yeah. yeah. 
Well, Futurama. I, I, I need to watch that, too. So there's like 500 TV shows that you watch now. And so. Archer. Archer is amazing. Well, I, I watched the first season of Archer. I was like, oh, it's so fucking funny. And then the second one aired. I was like, oh, God, I missed it. And I missed it. And I missed <laughs> it every freaking Netflix. week. Yeah, I know. It's all, all on Netflix. I just I, I actually have the third season on DVD. Matt, what was oh. it? The last se- I think it was fourth, third season, was it? Where it started out with just Archer thinks he's Bob from Bob's Burgers. Yes. <laughs> and it was just like, it was like the crossing of worlds for John, for H. John Benjamin. Yeah, because like, he was oh, the main character in Bob's Burgers. Bob, he's Bob in Bob's Burgers, and he's, he voices Archer. So it's just like, oh, God, universes are colliding. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Futurama. <laughs> Futurama. Yeah, yeah, Futurama. So, America. <laughs> what else is there? Uh, th- that's all. That's all the games and movies that are coming out this week that we we can remember. Was that everything? Oh, that's pretty much it. There's only one thing we got to do. Oh, I think it's well, we can do this one oh, next uh, week. Quick thing, just because this is interesting. Before we, I have like my IGN emails and everything. Okay. Um, oh God, what um, happened? Uh, what happened? Um, the Rock may have spoiled. That he's going to be John Stewart in the Green Lantern movie. The that that the wasn't spoiled. That was a rumor going around. Yeah, you know what? Okay, I just that, I just heard this now. It was like the Are day that they announced that Marvel was talking to uh, Johnny Depp. Like the next yeah. day, it was said, "Oh, there's a rumor that DC is talking to Dwayne Johnson about starring in a movie." Yeah. So, well, since the, since DC and Marvel have been a huge war with each other, but like, so I'm not sure for every to those who are listening, if in case you didn't know, that's a rumor that. I'm not sure if I actually hate. I don't hate it. Yeah, it's, I it's like, like Dwayne it's Johnson. Like, yeah, it's like when I heard Jesse Eisenberg. No, I like him as an, be, uh, yeah. I hated just, it at first, and then I thought about. it. I was like, you know what? It, he's pretty much if he was, play, if he plays Mark Zuckerberg, perfect. There actually, was one that's thing. The reason why I everyone was, I was, was doubtful. The idea. Everyone really? was okay. doubtful, and then someone the other day put up Photoshop. fan art. Uh, Photoshop. You look good. And it was just like one of those things where it's like. It was. It actually looked good, and it's like yeah. you know what? I, I actually think I could do, I could deal with that. I just I do hate good. though how everyone yeah. has completely ignored the fact that Jeremy Irons is Alfred. Well, but Jer- Jeremy Irons is awesome. So yeah, I know. But I'm like, I thought fine. people would be happier about that. I, yeah, I'd but, be pissed but, if it was Larry the Cable guy. At least he's fucking <laughs> Jeremy Irons. <laughs> he ain't Superman. Hey, what's going on today, big man? Hey, I was Mater. <laughs> Cars. Oh my god, it's gonna be the greatest day of my life in America. <laughs> oh, America. I'm gonna take down a Superman. What am I gonna do? Suplex. Also, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm looking through I'm this, uh, the news, too. Uh, they're trying to, uh, looks like they might have hired a director for the Uncharted movie. Oh, man. Oh, Seth I'm, Gordon. Oh, God. Oh, Seth Gordon, isn't that the guy that did a. Uh... King of Kong. I love King of Kong. He yeah. also did uh, Horrible so, Bosses, I think. So Horrible Bosses and Identity Theft. He can do the done. comedy. Mm. Uh, identity Thief do... suck, but those other yeah. two were good. Well, the I'm original ideas they, just they, need they had uh, Well, here's the thing. They just well, need Bruce Campbell. The original ideas they had for, oh, yeah, it for was... Uncharted was a family movie. For those who don't <laughs> yeah. know this, this... Yeah. Well, this travesty that was almost released upon yeah. us. Joe Pesci was going to play, like, his uncle or something yeah. like that? Yeah. It was going to be turned into a family movie where <laughs> it's... Where Mark Wahlberg was going to be, um, I guess, Drake. was going to be Nathan Drake. Joe Pesci was going to be his uncle. Yeah. Which I guess was either... May or may not have been Sully. Yeah, and then, I'm, not, I'm not sure if it was And Sully. then I forget, but there was going to be... And then his dad yeah. was also going to be, like, in another, like... I'm gonna say for now, like fucking Danny DeVito. <laughs> <laughs> Danny DeVito. No, actually, I just want to see him climb no, up a wall. No, it was it was actually Robert De Niro. I'm sorry, it was actually Robert fu- De Niro. I, I can't picture Robert De Niro climbing up in it. Yeah, so that's he, he just one. has that face. This was the original. <laughs> <laughs> I wish this was a video. Uh, but this, yeah, this, this yeah. It, it's just just mass. That was just, yeah. that's, that's what we were almost giving has. people. <laughs> If you're not angry right now, now go be, find something to be angry about. To, to be fair, the guy that was going to direct that is the guy that did American Hustle, Silver Linings Playbook, uh, The Fighter, all these Academy Award winning movies. So if there's any the chance that movie was going to be fucking good, it might be with him, but it wouldn't be Uncharted at yeah. that point. It might as well just be called Indiana Jones Reborn. Well, some shit. Is, well, it's the same thing since the... Well, I mean, like, what, Christopher Nolan and is uh, producing... And um, oh, I'm forget, oh, forgetting his name. Zack right Snyder. Now. And Zack Snyder is making um, ba- uh, Batman Superman. Yeah, yeah. But all these incredibly weird, like 
role choices like yeah. like, Jesse like Jesse Eisenberg yeah. out of the fucking left field. Yeah, I, 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 I'm actually interested. I'm more interested than pissed. I'm actually curious yeah. at this point. I mean, well, just, but just like Wonder when Heath Ledger Woman? was casted yeah. as a Joker, I was like, yeah. oh, that's weird. Well, well, yeah, he was amazing. That. Well, well, speaking I, of casting, I thought it was weird though. I was yeah. like, yeah, maybe but he's Wonder a good actor. Well, just on a quick thing, I was just looking up casting. They just announced B. J. Novak's. Uh, do, what is uh, like who he's playing in the Spider-Man new Spider-Man movie? Yeah, Alistair Smith. Who's that? Uh, did you watch the Amazing Spider-Man or yeah. the, the, the first yeah. one? Yeah, yeah, of course, yeah. yeah, that we used to be on like Saturday mornings. Oh, you mean the cartoon? No, no. You, uh, uh, I didn't did talk you, about the movie. Did you, Matt? He was the guy that was worked with the Kingpin that was in uh, always in a wheelchair, and he always made the robots that go and kill Spider-Man. Yeah. So pretty much that means sometime in this movie, Spider-Man's gonna have to fight a giant army of robots. He's already to fighting him. too many motherfuckers. Jesus, are you talking about this new movie? Yeah. This so is the second one or the third the one? The second one. This one. He's already fighting Electro, Rhino, and fucking uh, it's Harry Green Osborn. Go- yeah, like, Green Goblin or Hob Goblin, don't know. They also know, address either. the fact, clear as day, Dr. Octopus and Vulture are in yeah. the, in the, the Sinister Six. Future. Is gonna this be is, that, yeah. well, actually, the re- the setup for that might be the the announced Venom and the Sinister Six. Well, no, that wasn't... That the, might be for that. I don't think so, because those were filmed beforehand, and those didn't actually get anywhere until recently oh, okay. so those scenes were already filled so i think it's just there to set to show this could happen this is all a possibility that we're not going off of any of sam raimi's yeah good but kind of boring crap yeah we're gonna say sam raimi also never movie. forgive my uncle he worked on sit with in uh, dark man and i still haven't gotten to meet oh, sam raimi i love dark, dark man, man. Hey, have you hey, seen Dark, Dark Man? man. Hey, I love it. I love the ending. Julie! <laughs> <laughs> My favorite line. I'm like, come on, leave me. Hey, Dark Man, what are you doing? Everybody's already dead. <laughs> <laughs> I am quoting something insanely old. Congrats you are one you ugly it. son of a bitch. <laughs> if, if you don't know it, see the movie because it's, 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 it's so a fantastic movie. Yeah, I would never go explain movie. what it's about. Just watch it. It's, it's so good. Honestly, even Neeson, if we yeah. explained it, it just make it more confusing. Anything with Liam Neeson is at least worth watching once. <laughs> Once. Which, which brings Once. us to A Million Ways to Die in the West, right. yeah, which is going to be fantastic. Yeah. yeah I mean, it, it looks good. Uh, it's gonna Matt hasn't seen the trailer yet. No, nope. but uh, we'll, should, I'll, I'll we'll, we'll show that to you before we go. Yeah. I don't yeah. even know what time it is. Uh, it's uh, uh, 10. Oh my God. 11. So we could, what, an hour and a half of this? Oh, yeah. Okay. It's been a long time. Uh, just one last thing. No We're not going to talk about it too much. We should just talk about random stuff now because no one's listening at this hey, blah, point. Blah, 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 blah. They, they all checked out 45 minutes ago. <laughs> I, I'm thinking maybe I should cut this in like two parts. I would say yeah. Okay. I'll yeah. cut it in two parts just for people I don't want to listen to all of it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Um, just one last thing. Just one last thing. Uh, I wanted to talk about Tales of Zillia. Uh, I have not finished it yet, though. So I have do not you think we should wait until maybe next week or whenever next time we can do this? Yeah. To actually like, maybe next week. do a sp- well. Actually, you didn't play it, did you? No, and I probably won't. Okay, there. so you don't care if we do like a spoiler thing. <clears throat> I usually don't care, and even if you do spoil it, I'm not okay. actually a, the okay. person that gets Tales pissed. Are you, great. Ninety percent of the time, I know what happens in games and movies before. Yeah, it's it's not actually. Gonna, actually, actually Tales of Zillia does kind of do a couple things. Yeah, it, it's that I completely and I. And like, there's like, there's some good, there's, there's moments of gaming where I call shit. Yeah. That is that is well, it, not seen, but it, it happens. But like, Tailzilla has done some kind of crazy shit actually. Yeah. That I was like, oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Like, shit that, just got real. Yeah, it actually does it to me like it does it a couple times too. It's yeah. fucking weird. It's actually, you know what? It's a very fun. Like all the characters are really entertaining, but yeah. it, it even get it gets depressing sometimes. Like I was like, oh come on, man! I just fucking watch Full Metal Alchemist. And every yeah. episode is just, it's just oh, a fucking. Feels... De- I mean, I didn't watch every episode, but I just watched it. I'm like, all right, let's play this fun, happy game. Oh, okay. I, also, <laughs> I think that's what we need to link in like one of our let's plays is that video I showed you two the other day where it was Giles things uh, synced up the Hughes's uh, funeral. Oh, and it just went from you. such a sad scene to just like one of the most epic things in anime history. Guile's yeah. theme, as much as I love it, I have replaced it with yeah. one of the themes from Attack on Titan. Well, it wasn't um, even just, that. It was just the like fact. One of their glory theme. It was just the mm-hmm. fact that I mean, it, it synced so up. Bad. Like, oh, it was right. It's like everything happening in the funeral synced up with the tone of the music perfectly. Yeah. But no, I don't know if you've seen it. They've had there have been two videos that have gone up online of hockey fights. 
One of which there was a fight broke out in the stadium. Not someone on YouTube. The stadium started playing the punch out theme. And then there was another stadium. They started duking it out and they started playing Guile's theme. It was just like, <laughs> it's just so great that you know there's someone up in that up in the sound booth with like the biggest smile on their face. Like I've been, <laughs> I've been waiting for this since I got this job. This is a dream come true. I can't wait just to <laughs> see the videos on YouTube. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, Tales of Zillia, because yeah. we immediately betrayed our word. What was yeah. that, what was that <laughs> yeah. for? Was that just PlayStation? Or? It's PlayStation, PlayStation 3. 3. I didn't know yeah. there was a sequel coming out this year. Yep. Yeah. I had no fucking they, idea. I, I was looking up, off. like, all right, Tales of Zillia anime, and then I looked up, and I was like, oh, Tales of Zillia 2. Oh, I ain't coming out for a little while. It, it was already out in Japan for, since 2011, I think. Yeah. yeah. And it, or it's 2012 or something like that. And it's coming out this year in America. I was like, oh, I better yeah, fucking hurry. It, it's... Yeah. it's it's, it's gonna sound. I, I never beat Zillia, actually. You so never did. I never beat Zillia. I oh, got. Okay. I got very. F uh, at least as far as I think is very far. Okay. I'm not quite sure. I don't want to say anything yeah, until, mm -hmm. and I'm not sure how far, how much we want to spoil it for like listeners. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, I got about 25 hours in. So. Well, I'm we, not sure where that is. Yeah. We'll, spent we'll, a lot we'll of time. deal, that we'll deal with the. Yeah. We'll deal with the chaos of Dragon's Crown and yeah. Gerard yeah. Yeah. <laughs> before we get to that. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. I just want to say. For right now, because ne next week, if is there any way you can maybe like try to finish it if you have time? What I don't have a PS3 now. So. Oh, you don't have a PS3. It's it's okay. I I can hear how it ends. I I actually I'm not in, I'm not that invested in the story. Oh really? But I okay. really like Zil like uh, sorry Tales games. Okay. Like yeah. Symphonia is always is probably yeah. still like Lloyd is probably one of the best characters. Right. Mm -hmm. Well, they actually they have an HD uh, collection coming out for the PS3 for Tales of Symphonia One and Two. Yeah. So I'm gonna yeah. I'll probably get that. Okay. Um, so that's I want, I want to play Zeno, to I haven't played yeah, yeah. Xeno Saga in forever, and I want to get I want to play that again. I can't get back uh, into Xeno Saga. Those well, six Zeno Saga. Hours. Zeno Saga. Is so I want to play both of those again. Six hour cutscenes. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's nothing. No, it's a uh, Asuka's wrath. Are you sure? Asuka's 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 the, well, that's oh, a whole the cutscene. opening forty-five minute long quick time event. Are you saying Ashura? Ashura, yeah. Azura's Wrath. Yeah. yeah. The opening that's forty-five minute that's, long quick time event. Six hour cutscene. Yeah, that's it. It's just all right. Oh, now I get to fight a little bit. Okay, cutscene. Oh, it's not cutscene. Fuck. Right, uh, <laughs> quick time event. Oh, I just I just blew up the moon. Event. All right. Uh, all right. Okay. He just he just put his thumb down on the earth. Okay. <laughs> I'm dead. I guess. Didn't uh one of our friends John? Didn't John? One of the days of class, didn't he? Uh, tr we were like in between classes, and we just spent that and that whole time. He just went into one of the classrooms, put that on a projector, and just watched that whole yeah. sequence. Yeah, no, he yeah. watched it. He, he watched uh, like a, a few trailers of it. No, uh, it wasn't that. It no, was the he, actual sequence. Okay. Like I remember, because he came and got us and dragged us into the room and he had to watch it. Big finger coming down. So like, what the fuck we're, is going yeah, on? Yeah, it was like, are you we spent two shot? hours between <laughs> classes watching that, and we all left the room just like, what the hell did we just watch? <laughs> uh, yeah, that game. I really liked it. The story was fun. There's no real likable characters, but uh, <laughs> nope. it was just fun to watch what fucking crazy shit was gonna happen next. <laughs> Maybe your master was the best character. That's it. The master who? Who's Chapter that? two. Okay, I don't remember. Uh, <laughs> it's been a long time. Yeah, yeah. Fight him uh, on the moon. he's worse than that. He's going, "Who's the master?" And I'm you going, "Wait, the master from Doctor Who." You fight him on the moon. He's got the oh him. He's, he's oh got okay. The power pole yeah. extend sword. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's fucking the, the ridiculous. Goku sword. Yeah, it's I love the Goku sword. I love how isn't that the one you just. You just kill the guy that's like a giant or something, and then the next boss fight is you're fighting on the moon. Yeah, and he doesn't he just split the moon in half with his fucking pole. Yep. Yeah. Like, okay. <laughs> all right. We yeah. had big giant dudes that could poke at the earth, and now the and whole now we have and a, now all of Earth is going to be flooded. Yeah. <laughs> great. Fucking uh, Kratos doesn't make this much problem for people, and he just kills all and the gods. Kratos does his best to make the worst <laughs> problems. He he murders the gods Kratos that Kratos tries his best to screw up the world as much as he can, and in doing so, actually makes the world a better place. Am I the only one who thinks Kratos is possibly the worst video game character ever created? Of course, because he I tries like to kill everyone, and instead saves everyone. I you know what? I kind of like that through magic that, bullshit and unicorn. We play too many. <laughs> we play too many fucking games where the main character is just the good. Too huge. I I love everything. I need to save everything. Kratos is just like fuck everything, and he just literally, murders literally, everything. Literally, he literally tries to yeah, fuck everything. Yeah. There's a part where you use a, and then, a, 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 a who is it? Athena is just watching the whole time, just like okay, you know, you, just just sleep with those whores. You use I'm this, not comfortable with you watching me sleep with them. You use this busty uh, woman. I think I think she's Poseidon's wife. I can't remember. You use her as a door wedge just yeah. to get, yeah. get through. You, you could use any box in the in the environment, yeah. but you use a woman just like. Fuck 
fuck, get on there, hold it. And it's like, <laughs> zoop, and she gets crushed to death. Yep. I was like, oh, wow, okay, well, that's an asshole. That, I it's mean, like, hey, at you're least supposed you don't have to worry about uh, child support after this. You're supposed to fuck her. <laughs> I just saved you a hundred bucks, fucker. You're, you're, suppo- you're supposed to fuck her, not fuck her <laughs> up. I just, say, you're, I just saved you half your shit. <laughs> <laughs> that's about a lifetime of saving I did there. <laughs> Uh, uh, this thing's gonna go to sleep in ten minutes. Which okay. Is, well, we're, 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 we're pretty much before that. We're done anyway. So there you go. Uh, that's the podcast. You got any last words? I don't have any anything. last words. I don't have anything else we're, to say. For we're some, marching off to our death. After rules this. of nature. <laughs> 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 say uh, that all freaking day. I love that song. <laughs> it's because Who's is that? Because what? Oh, that's the. Uh, that's I guess I don't know what the name of the. Of the uh, Metal Gear it is, but it's the one with the tutorial fight. Oh, Ray? Yeah. I was going to say, is it it's what, actual fight, or is it just one of the, it's the one couple you, of uh, generic no, fighting? No, no, it's the one where you like, climb up his arm and then you have to run down the building. Tell you. If that's Ray, then uh, yeah. That, 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 Ray. Also, just on a quick side note, that game had one of the most pain in the ass achievements, which is trying to cut his tail off. Metal Gear Rays. I think I got he it. Just, I, I got it too, but it's such a pain in the ass because you only get about a second to do it. Yeah. And then yeah. you have to wait another five minutes before you get a chance. Yeah. So, anyway, any, any other last words? <laughs> before we march off to our death. Yeah. This is the last time they'll be on. They're going to their death. I don't know who I'm going to replace now. Gerard's dead. And yeah. You guys are going to be dead. Gerard, so. Gerard's not dead, but he's dead to us for tonight. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, we, we got we got a lot of videos coming out. Aside oh, from that, oh yeah, we got a shit ton of videos. I actually mentioned it last week that we're doing the gore cast thing. Yeah. Uh, so we have a bunch of them coming out. Outlast is going to be one of them. I spoiled it. I don't care. Yeah. Um, I think we, we mentioned well, it. Well, right I don't know if we'll get the Outlast. There's tonight, two other ones that we're also doing. Should Should we not mention well, those? Well, they're not. Uh, well, because I, we, I we think we give should, a bit of a warning. Well, I think we could say we killer talked about is them dead. in the podcast. I think, I think we'll say killer is dead because yeah. we've already kind of alluded to that yeah. a couple of times. Here's the thing, it. though, is that it's not really a huge. Like the starting of the, all this isn't a huge let's play. It's more of Chris has not finished a lot of games, so it's more of like a uh, forced uh, play. Uh, killer <laughs> is dead. We, we're gonna call it's it's. It'll go by the official name of. For, uh, forced like a forced play let's play yeah because so we're pretty much it's forcing him he, uh, he uh, you have what like th- 300 360 games alone yeah and out of all those maybe 20 to 30 of them you've actually finished oh I finished way more than that yeah, yeah right. give me some fucking credit here. No, no, I am giving you credit I've, I've, I've finished a lot of games I'm giving you a 20 or 30 I, I can name like at least 10 games right off the top of my head that I yeah that's why uh, yeah that doesn't help what years ago or or what? no recently. just, just <laughs> to, like why am I looking at the collection I can name fucking 10 of them I can so, name a lot of them. You right got four hundred games. It wouldn't be hard to say ten random games. I've finished a lot of those games. Yeah, but so pretty much we've got to the point where we now have to start forcing him to finish games. I finished a lot of them twice too. So, mm. no, nah, that, that's like maybe three, four games you finished twice. You know what? I'm playing shit like Tales of Zillia, which is like fifty hours long. Yeah, so it's give me a long. fifty hours long, and you'll play six. Yeah, I, I play, I'm he's, up to 25. Yeah, he's halfway through. What, what you talking about? I play 25 hours of that shit. Shit, it's, it's Black History oh, Month. It's Black History Month. Black History Month. We gotta month. incorporate it, man. Yeah, that word's available for now. <laughs> Alright, so anyway. We all good. We, we so, all good? <laughs> we all good. I'll bring you brownies. <laughs> And shit. Not not like pop brownies, just really good like double chocolate brownies. They're like, really good. Really good pop brownies. pop brownies. Yeah, we'll bring pop brownies. Those are for me. <laughs> we'll bring it for Matt so he can get really high. I, j- I just need I just need beer. You get me I'm beer. I'm so high right now. I I just need I just need. You just sex. need love. You just need love. <laughs> I just need love. Or a cat. He needs heroin. He needs pot. Dude, need... dude, dude. No, no, <laughs> wine. I need wine. I don't do heroin. I can't okay. replace not it. Anymore. I need I need wine. Wine. Dude, I love, I love Ooh, wine. I, I, mean, I like to drink so wine. Horrible, no, it's just because there's so many horrible beers and there's a lot more good wine. Do you hold the glass like this with the with the thing at, like this, and then do you like spin it around too, like a fucking well, ass? Yeah, you have to. He only <laughs> watches Cougar Town. Well, well, no, what? Oh God, no. <laughs> oh, no. Well, no one, Courtney Cox is so funny. One, one that's the easiest way to hold the glass, and two, you actually have to stir. You have to do it like that so you get the most flavor out of it. Yeah. Because oh, okay. you have to aerate it, or else it'll taste like shit. That's why no I drink beer. Is. There is no learning curve. It's yeah, but beer. <laughs> yeah, but beer is like Budweiser, Bud Light, all the Bud and Coors. Oh, and those are all terrible. Yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about like Heineken, Corona, Guinness. Yeah, and that all Good no shit. Corona is piss water. I love no, but Corona. Corona, Heineken, and all that's expensive as hell to buy. 
it is. But that's why I, that's why I stick with wine because it's you get a lot more out of it than beer. So I'm starting <laughs> to drink ale. <laughs> yeah, same here. I do ale and draft uh, all the time. Whiskey, I don't do yeah, just this generic. Unless it's Kronbacher, Kronbacher all the time. Mm. And all Chris, right. Chris has no idea about this because you don't <laughs> drink because you're a pussy. I don't drink. I'm straight edge. I don't do that you're shit. You're not straight edge. Straight I, edge. I'm straight There's edge. There's coke but... under the laptop. Well, so? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Coke's for... <laughs> Coke's for, Coke's for winners. <laughs> Coke is for winners. Ask Charlie Sheen. What is to live by, kids? Just ask Carlos Estevez. <laughs>